We are just trying to get some work done in between classes. I have a class in like 45 minutes. Yeah, 45 minutes. So I'm going to try to read a little bit and take a quiz. All of our quizzes and tests are online, which has been really nice because then you can take it whenever you're ready. Um, so yeah, I'm just eating my the rest of my smoothie bowl and drinking some coffee in my favorite Gilmore Girls mug. We're back! I'm back from my class. I am officially done with classes for today. I told you guys PE was cancelled, right? Not PE. Weight training. Weight training is cancelled because our favorite teacher, Miss Slaughter, has had a sinus infection. So her doctor wants her to stay home, which is kind of sad, but also nice because now I get an extra hour. But yeah, Allison is eating her ramen. She's a big fan. Typical. <laughs> and I just got some packages from Amazon. They're actually for my best friend Naomi's baby shower this weekend, but I figured I would go ahead and show you guys what I got. Let's see. Oh, I don't know why I'm acting surprised. I'm the one that bought all this stuff. Okay, so what is this? Oh, right. Okay, so I got her these little swaddle blankets. You can't see, like, what they actually look like, but this is, like, a sneak peek of the pattern. Levi, the baby's room, is <laughs> it's all black, white, and gray with, like, kind of woodland creatures, but woodland creatures that are black and white, if you know what I'm saying. So, like, panda bear, zebra, and stuff like that. But, yeah. So, all of his stuff is black and white. And then, oh, these are so cute. They're little like baby bibs, but they look like little bandanas. So they're like all these different kinds of patterns and stuff, super cute. And then these little socks. Oh my gosh, these are adorable. Literally, he's gonna be the most stylish baby ever. I'm so excited. And a little bottle brush because you know, to clean the baby bottles, we need that. I believe this is his hamper. Isn't that adorable? Yeah. But if you know Naomi, she is in love with Buffalo Check everything. I'll have to get like a video of her house or like some pictures and show you guys. It's really cute. But yeah, so his room is obviously going to have Buffalo Check in it. So that's the first box. I went a little crazy, but you know, you have to when it's your nephew. And let's see. What's in here? Oh, these are his onesies. These are adorable. <laughs> Okay, so you can't see all of them. Actually, I should just go ahead and take them out of the packaging. I'm just gonna show you guys. Okay, so I think it was a pack of five, six. Six, yeah. So this one says, be kind to the animals. Oh, that's so cute. They're all Gerber because he only gets the best. <laughs> Camouflage, obviously for the boy. This one is adorable. Yeah. Yellow with some like different colored triangles on it. Oh, this one's cute too. It's like a, what would you call this? Like what color green would that be? Um, like, not for, no, not for. I would say forest green. Is it forest green? Yeah. Forest green with a little tiger face on it. So cute. I feel like I keep saying so cute, but it's a, it's true. And then this is neutral. So it's like, 
nude and white, I guess, stripes, little onesie. And then this one says, oh, it says the same thing, be kind to animals. And it has a leopard, or is that a tiger? I don't know, little animals on it, but they're so cute. And I'm so excited to um, be there for the baby shower and see her again. It's been a bit, but yeah. Okay, this, this is our little mini fitness room in our dorm. There's a bigger one in the sports center, but I normally go to the gym, like Planet Fitness, but I've just been trying to get back into running because I have a half marathon next weekend. Um, so this is our little mini fitness room. We have two bikes, we have a stair stepper, two ellipticals, and two treadmills. So yeah. <laughs> Car. I'm sure you guys already know, but it's so nice because it's literally right behind my building. My building or my room is like right up there. Like one, two, three, four. Oh gosh, five. It's like right there. That's my room. And my car is right here. So it's not a far walk at all. And I love that. So my roommates just got done with class. So we're gonna go get some coffee. It's become like a Wednesday tradition for us because we have a nice little hour in between their last class and our church service because church for us is at five. And um, yeah, so we've just liked to go get coffee in between. So we're gonna take you along and show you one of our favorite um, Pensacola local coffee shops. So. Is it really my car if it's not playing country music? That's the real question. Um, also, aren't these so cute? My friend Erica made this. I love it. And then these are my kukui nut oil, 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 kukui nut, whatever it's called. Those things from Hawaii from my friend Megan. So, anyways. When I first laid eyes on you. Oh gosh, that's right. some entertainment for you that's all i care about these people are probably looking at me saying why is she talking to herself but i'm not talking to you guys they just don't know i'm a vlogger because i'm not viral it's fine i will be viral one day just kidding that's not the intimate goal in my life although it would be nice this is awkward all right <laughs> hi roommates hi hi the film is running so say hello oh Hello. <laughs> that always happens to you. Becca's in the back, and we are going. I never look in the camera. Never. All right, we're gonna go. It's a beautiful day, the sun is shining, the birds are chirping, Allison is blowing, and we're walking to church. This is my dinner for tonight. I have a veggie bowl, a salad from Chick-fil-A, and some grilled nuggets, and I'm going to watch some YouTube while I eat dinner. Hello, I'm in the laundry room. Had to be sure no one was in here. That would have been embarrassing. Um, yeah, so this is our laundry room. There's five washing machines, five dryers, not that you really care. Just thought I'd let you know. It's been a while since I've done my laundry. Not a while, but last week, and I go through a lot of clothes. Not because I change a lot, just because, well, yeah, I guess I do change a lot. You know, pajamas, and then workout clothes, school clothes, and then comfy clothes. I change a lot. You change that. 
Anyways, I'm gonna do my laundry, so I'm gonna put this on a time lapse for you to enjoy. <laughs> night 8 21 and it's time for me to start working on stuff i have some tests to study for i have um a quiz i have to take tonight i'm listening to my chill playlist on spotify and i have a little snack some almond butter in my little measuring cup and a green apple it's been like my go-to snack at night and then the rest of my coffee from earlier it was really good. I don't think I told you what I got. But I got a honey lavender iced coffee with an extra shot of espresso. It's really good. Anyway, so I'm going to get crack a into doing this stuff. Wish me luck. <laughs> that already you know what whatever it's fine um so i've been studying for my weight training quiz and i finished my laundry haven't put it away yet because i need to take this now but yeah so i'm gonna take this quiz and then i'll check back in with you but this, this is my nighttime routine i get ready for bed and the girls talk to their boys and i'm here all alone <laughs> Do you want to be part of the vlog? Michael, say hi. Oh, we can't hear him. <laughs> we can't see him. <laughs> we can't see him either, but it's fine. He's there. He's not imaginary. Believe me. Like my imaginary boyfriend, you can't see him. I'm <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> I do not have an imaginary boyfriend. <sighs> hey, this might go up on YouTube. <laughs> so you can watch it. Yeah, Michael, I better see a like and subscribe from, um, what's his last name? Agmalian. Michael Agmalian. <laughs> You should subscribe to Aileen's channel. Oh my gosh, please do. <laughs> What's he saying? He's so <laughs> what did he say? He said, he said now he, he's like, why did you tell her my last name? Now she can find me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Michael thinks I'm a weirdo. <laughs> he's never going to let Allison see him again after this year. I mean, I'm telling you, he can't do that. I mean, things get serious. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. Duh. Um, so okay, yeah, I'm, I, oh, it is, believe me. Michael's getting a shout out and everything. <laughs> Anyways, I'm getting ready for bed, but I'm technically not going to bed because I still have a lot of work to do. I took my two quizzes today. I started working on the project, but I still have a test to take tomorrow, so I'm going to study for that, work a little bit on the project, do my devotions, and then go to bed. So I'm going to be up late, but it's fine, because I don't have anything until 10, which is chapel. So, yeah. I might bring you guys along for tomorrow. Not really sure yet. But, yeah. I'll keep you updated. <laughs> The next day. Good morning, YouTube. I am having to extend this vlog an extra day because I didn't end it last night and I just feel like there's more exciting things to happen today, so why not bring you along? Anyways, I went to bed around like two o'clock this morning, I think. I was working on my projects and did my devotions and like studied a little bit for that test I have to make up. So yeah, at least I got that done. And then I had chapel at 10 and now I'm heading to the gym. I'm going to Planet Fitness today to do a little weight training slash a mini run. And yeah, after that, I'm gonna probably go to a coffee shop and work on some stuff just because I have a lot to do, you know? And it's a busy day today and you're gonna be along to experience it with me. So yay you. Also, if you are wondering if I'm wearing the exact same sweater I was wearing yesterday, 
You are absolutely right, and I have no shame in it. I'm wearing it with a different top and a different skirt, so it shouldn't be a big deal. Also, it's just so cute and comfy. Like, why wouldn't I wear it again? You know what I'm saying? I got it from H&M the other night. I think it was like 18 bucks, which isn't too bad for like my favorite sweater now, so yeah. Also, I'm gonna eat a little snacky. Ew, I just said snacky. I'm gonna eat a little snack before I head to the gym. This is a Verb Energy Bar. Ooh, she cute, she cute. And it's the pumpkin spice latte flavor. If you haven't heard about Verb Energy, they are a gluten-free, dairy-free, vegan energy bar um, producer, I guess. And all of their ingredients are clean and they all also taste like super amazing. And this just happens to be one of my favorite flavors. They're only 90 calories and they have as much caffeine as a shot of espresso, but instead of putting ca like espresso or like another form of caffeine in it, they would use green tea leaves. I will never be sponsored. Anyways, but yeah, so if you haven't checked out Verb Energy, go follow them on Instagram. It's a pretty easy thing to do. All you have to do is basically they give you a number and you text them what you want every month. So if you want one pack of 12 of like the pumpkin spice latte, you just set, you just text them and they will text you every month right before your um, order goes out to see if you want to change your flavor or if you want to push back your order. It's super easy, super simple. You don't have to call and they don't have to call you or you don't have to subscribe for an email or anything. Like I love it. It's the best. Anyways, I'm going to head out to the gym for a good workout and I will see you guys later. One hour later. I am back. I've just finished at the gym and I definitely stayed a lot longer than I was anticipating. I think I ended up working out for like almost an hour and I wanted to only be there for like 30 to 45 minutes but like once I get going I just don't want to stop because I'm there and I'm like starting to feel good about like the weights I'm doing or like how much I'm running and stuff and I just want to keep going but I was like, I kept checking the time and I was like, I have other stuff I need to be getting done, so I need to go. And so, um, yeah. I ended up running a mile and I did a bunch of like arm, like weightlifting and leg press and stuff like that. And then I showered and got ready and then got creepily stared out by this guy but as I was walking out. He was probably thinking, why is she wearing a skirt? She just got out of the gym, but it's fine whatever anyway so now I'm going to go to the coffee guy again I really want to take you guys to like a different coffee shop today one to show you something different also because I want a different coffee but it's right here and I have to be back at school in like an hour so might as well just go there because it's more convenient you know what I'm saying anyways I will see you in a minute So I finished at Coffee Guy. I would have loved to stay longer because I was like really getting in the groove and getting stuff done. But I have a meeting in like 12 minutes. So yeah, I have to get back to campus. Don't worry, I'm not running late. It's literally like five minutes away, so I'll be fine. Um, but I wanted to come on here and let you guys know what God has been teaching me. I told you yesterday about how um, I felt like he was really talk, like speaking to me about seeing people through his eyes and just loving them the way he would love them. Um, so that was really good. And then yesterday I was reading about, um, about prayer in my devotions and how um, we can go to God for, to, we can go to God for anything. Um, specific, whether it's big or little or whatever, um, going to him and intentionally praying um, and just trusting that like he will answer our prayers the way that he sees fit, even if it's not always the way we would want them to be answered. Um, so yeah, that's just like a little bit about what I've been learning. But I was also thinking like, I was telling you guys how I kind of felt like I was going through like a spiritual drought 
and I've kind of felt that honestly for like the past year probably just off and on like I'll have my highs and I'll have my lows in my relationship with God where like some days I feel like I'm learning so much and I could just like keep reading and learning and learning and then there's other days when when I read and I feel like I'm getting nothing and then there's days that I go throughout the day and I don't pray to him at all or I only pray to him like once and it's just like a quick prayer and I really want to get out of that habit again because I used to talk to him a lot more I feel and I feel like that only ever comes when like something bad happens and I don't want that to be the case like I want to have a continual relationship with him and a strong relationship with him um and it just kind of brought me back to the verse that says when you seek God you will find him and I've really felt that honestly the last couple days because I've been like intentionally sitting down and taking time to like read my devotions and if I don't get something out of it right away I will keep reading or I will go to another passage of the Bible and I will read until I get something out of it and it's all about intentionality and that's on actually that's like one of my words that I chose for this year was intentionality I want to be more intentional in my relationship with God my relationship with other people um, I want to be intentional in just my goals for the year and everything so intentionality is key to growing in your relationship with God and growing in your relationship with others um, but yeah I just like that promise that like when you seek God you will find him um, because he's there and if you're reaching out his arms are wide open and he will answer you and he will reveal himself to you if you will let him so yeah that's just a little quick encouragement for the day now i'm going to try to get to school on time and hopefully not be late for the meeting 12 seconds later a little annoyed because my appointment was canceled as soon as i got there apparently the person i was supposed to meet with is tied up so now i have to wait till monday so I rushed back to campus for nothing, and then Brandon said he's gonna be late for this video we're supposed to make. <laughs> Allison, last year, every once in a while, Hello. say hi to the vlog. Hello. It's a beautiful day. It is a beautiful. Say hi, Becca. Hi. We're just about to make eyes. a video. <laughs> yeah. So no laugh <coughs> at the first point. And Allison saw me her boyfriend, Michael, the one you met last night. And I did the video with my Bible club leaders, mm -hmm. and it was yeah. pretty hilarious, honestly. I mean, we got it done, yeah, I don't and we were not prepared. And I then I had the call with the guy from West Coast, and he was really nice, and he's helping me get ready to be out during the fall, so that's exciting. And now I'm working on my projects yeah. that I was what? working on earlier, and then I have to study for my test and take it, and then I'm going to dinner with one of my besties who you will meet later. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm with Isabella! I love her. I'm tired. I look really bad right now. No, you don't. <laughs> Honestly, like, if somebody just sat me down and they're like, here, eat this food, and just like, close your eyes. <laughs> like, it makes me want to stop chewing, you know? <laughs> like, it's soothing. Chewing is soothing? Yeah, like a baby, and then like, you stop. <laughs> and you let your face like, relax, you know? <laughs> Good. <laughs> We're at Target, of course. Whenever we're together, we always end up here. I know. I found these for my new nephew for the baby shower. <laughs> Three hours later. Hi, I am back from my little date with Isabella and I had so much fun. We were like out together for probably a little bit over three hours. Whenever I'm with her, it's just always so fun and we're just like always laughing and catching up. I don't get to see her that much anymore because she's an internship um, like I did last semester. And so she's at the academy all day and I'm here doing classes and our schedules are just crazy. Plus she's engaged and wedding planning and all this other stuff. So it's always nice when we get to hang out. Our food was delicious. Let me tell you, it was literally amazing. And obviously we went to Target. I got some more stuff for the baby, for the baby shower. 
and a couple other things that I didn't really need, but you know, that's what you do when you're at Target. And Starbucks was having a, they were selling their 50th anniversary cups for like two bucks. They're so cute. And I got the new um, chocolate almond milk espresso drink. So good. I highly recommend. I really need to end this vlog soon. So let me go change and then I'll probably end the vlog. Yeah, it is time for us to end the vlog because this has been going on for two days now. But if you've made it this far, thank you for watching. We had a lot of fun vlogging all of the random things that we do in a day as a college student or in two days. It was a very busy couple days, but it was fun. We made the most out of it. You have anything to say, Allison? Um, no. Just that I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. <laughs> if you <laughs> we'll see you next time. <laughs> yeah, and if you haven't already, like and subscribe. Have a good night. Bye. Or day. Thank you.